Today's video will be all about five passive income ideas that I personally will carry out in life to achieve that financial freedom. The ideas today can be done by each and every one of you. So follow along to the end and see how we each can start on our own passive income adventure. So keep on watching and welcome to the Mitch Green Project. If you have been following my videos up until now, you would know that I already started with passive income. In the last video, I did my very first investment. And just a little teaser for you guys, it is going very well. In the end of this month, I will post a video with the results of my first month with passive income. If you haven't seen my previous videos, I will encourage you to go watch them and keep following along. So before we get started with the five passive income ideas, I need to draw a new topic for my investment hat. If you remember, I have to invest each month $1,400 and I will also do it this month. But I need a topic and I will draw one now. Building. So follow along and see me when I invest in the business area, which is buildings. Cool, let's get started with the five passive income ideas. Today's first idea is writing a book of your own. There is an extremely good chance that you have some knowledge in your head that is worth sharing with other people. And if you do, people will pay for your knowledge. Your first task will be, what do I know a lot about and where do I know more than other people? What is important here is that you brand yourself as an expert of the topic. And maybe you sit back thinking, well, I'm not an expert in anything. To that I will say, I do not believe you. So if you're a 14 year old kid, chances are that you have a hobby you have spent hours and hours and hours on. It could be skating or drawing or surfing or anything that you consider yourself. This is my main hobby. Me personally, I've been playing a lot of guitar and maybe I could write a book about guitars as well. Or if you're a young mom, write about being a young mother. Chances are that you have experienced a lot of difficulties being a young mom and how to get through these difficulties could help another mother. Maybe you have someone with Alzheimer in your family. Write about how life is with Alzheimer in your family. You can help another person which maybe is in despair. What do I do now? And you can help people are willing to pay for that kind of knowledge. So sit down and use your fantasy. I ensure you that you have some knowledge in your head that is worth sharing. Me personally, I will write a book about depression and anxiety. I suffered from depression and anxiety 10 years ago. And I want to share my knowledge about how to get through it without any side effects in your future life. As soon as I'm done with this video, I will get started on writing this book. So now we have agreed on that everybody is an expert of something. So let's get to the next topic, which is creating an online course. So have you ever searched on YouTube or on Google how to do something? The how to keyword is one of the most used keywords on YouTube and on the internet. People want to learn something and they could do it online. So the very simple things belongs on YouTube, like how to tie a tie. But if you can create a course, help people get better at something, they are willing to pay you for it. I'm sure you have heard of Udemy.com where you can pay for online courses. And I have personally used it quite a lot when I want to learn something about drawing, I love drawing, or if I want to learn something about software, you can go to Udemy and get an online course. So all you need to get started is a camera, a computer, a topic, and some great content and then start to teach people online. Once you have it out there, it can get you continuously passive income. I'm not just telling you what you should do. I'm gonna do this stuff myself. And my first online course will be in software development. I want to teach people about robot framework and the test framework Selenium. And I will get started after I write my first book. Idea number three, create a YouTube channel. People love YouTube and they love original content. And all you need to get started making content on YouTube is a camera and a great idea. 
YouTube have more video views than Netflix and Facebook combined. And I know the competition is really, really hard on YouTube, but if you get one viral video, I promise you, it will change your life forever. There are several ways to earn money on YouTube. If you have enough subscribers and followers, you can start showing ads to the viewers. Each ad you show to your viewer will give you a small amount of money. This is not the only way to earn money on YouTube. You can, for instance, have affiliate links down in your descriptions. These links can point to products you have in your videos or maybe some of your equipment you're using for your YouTube studios. Try to check out some of the YouTube if you like. Maybe they have affiliate links and then you can get some inspiration. My best advice to start a YouTube channel is just do it and get started. And don't let perfect get in the way of better. If you expect your first videos to be perfect, you never get it done. If you watch some of my first videos, you will see there's tons and tons of mistakes. And you know what? That's all right. What really matters to me is to get my content out to you guys and then I will improve along the way. And something that's really important with YouTube, have a lot of fun. It should all be fun. Don't think about the money in the first place. If you don't enjoy making YouTube content, then it's not for you. Choose something else. Just to be realistic, that can go months and years before you have a breakthrough and maybe never. So what's most important, having fun, and then you haven't lost any time, am I right? The fourth passive income idea is creating a blog. In these days, blogs are really popular. And if you can get some traffic to your blog, you can actually earn quite a bit of money with ads, affiliates, and maybe sponsors. So to create a blog, you need to find a niche which fits you and start blog about it. Start blogging about something you love and something people could be interested in. You will feel so satisfied when you start to get traffic and have a community to talk with. But one thing I feel like I have to say is you have to be really, really creative. The competition is really hard on blogs. And if you want to start a blog about fashion, you should know that you will disappear in the flood of fashion blogs out there. Try to be creative and be unique. Today's last and fifth passive income idea is investing in stocks. So you might already figured out that investing your money and let them grow as part of a company can be a great way to earn passive income. But on this passive income idea, you need to have some money to invest in the first place. And of all the passive income ideas I come up with today, this is the one with the greatest risk, which means that you can actually lose the money you invested in. The other ones you can lose some time, but that's all. So if you're in doubt on how to get started, you can learn all about it on this channel. Go through my previous videos and follow along when I do my investments and share all the results with you guys. So that sums it up for today's passive income ideas. I hope I have encouraged you to start earning passive income. By clicking like and subscribe, you can follow me on YouTube doing all of these passive income ideas. I share all the results and you will get a grasp of how hard it is to get started and how rewarding it could be in the end. So keep following the Midscreen project and see you in the next video.